Gentlemen, my name is Justin Mark, international dating coach and relationship expert. And in this video, I'm gonna to talk to you about how to hook up with older women, how to hook up with MILFs, how to get older girls, how to get women who are a bit mature, more older than you, and how to kind of seduce them, keep them around and bring them in your life. Sit back, hang tight, and let's jump straight in. <laughs> So, boys, you see this beautiful girl, she's a little bit older than you, but you kind of like it. You kind of like the mommy vibes. You kind of like the sense of maturity that she has in her demeanor. You want this fucking girl. Well, so what do you do? What do you say? And how do you act and behave to get this girl? Well, I'll tell you guys a story. When I was 24 years old, I met this beautiful woman, beautiful, beautiful girl, and we met on the street. She told me she's 23 years old and I decided to make her my girlfriend. Later on, after dating her for like almost two months, I found out she was actually 30. And I was thinking like, why would this 30 year old woman lie to me about her age? And what actually happened is she liked my personality, my success at such a young age. She kind of wanted to like, you know, put a ring on it. Cause she wanted me to put a ring on her. And we started dating. and. I found that I've dated a lot of beautiful older women, even when I was really young. Like when I was 17, I hooked up with a woman who was 27. Or uh, when I was 24, I was friends with benefits with a woman who was like 33. Uh, when I was 24 years old, I hooked up with a woman who was 47. I had a lot of these experiences with older women who were very attractive. And I decided to kind of break down of why I'm able to get these older girls, these older elves, I guess you could say, and you know, keep them around, track them into my life. Now, I now choose not to do that. Uh, I prefer younger women. I prefer girls who are young, feminine, and beautiful. Um, obviously, girls who are like 20, 21, 22, you know, not the older girls anymore. But I'm gonna tell you exactly what to do. So the first thing is you wanna make sure if she's older than you, you carry yourself with a very high degree of class. This means dressing well, dressing more mature. So for example, what I like to do is I always like to suit up. I always like to look really good. And that way, if I'm meeting girls who are a little bit younger and that might intimidate them, like for example, girls like 19, 20, 21, well, I'll, you know, take off the blazer. I have a little dress collared shirt and I'm always looking good, but I'm always kind of like dressing for the girl I'm talking to or for the girl I'm trying to attract, right? And so. With older women, you gotta look more mature. You gotta maybe grow out a beard, look a little bit older, talk a little bit deeper, right? And also just act a little bit more mature, but still have fun because a lot of older women, uh, they want to have fun, young energy around them as well. And another thing I highly, highly recommend you do, and this is horrible, but I recommend you lie to the girl about your age. So this is number two. This is, you know, if you meet a girl who's 30 and you're a young guy, you're early 20s, mid 20s, look, you're 25 years old. Why don't you just tell her you're 28? Now, you don't have to lie. Sometimes the girl will like you, she'll just like you and it's fine, right? But sometimes a girl will be like, oh my God, you're 25. You're my little brother's age. You're way too young for me. You are too young. Sorry, can't happen. Well, if you just told her like you're 27 or 28, well, it wouldn't be that big of a deal. The age difference wouldn't be that far off. Now, if the girl's obviously older, I like to try to avoid talking about age in general. I, I try to not talk to her about her age, try not to ask how old she is, right? And just the last thing you wanna do before you've hooked up with a girl is ask her about her age, um, if she's older than you, because it could just cock block you. You're just gonna you know, sabotage yourself before you even get the opportunity to hook up with her. And so, what you wanna do is you wanna make sure she feels safe, comfortable, but also doesn't feel like you're a little kid. Like if she's obviously older than you, if this woman's in her thirties or older and you're younger and like, I don't know, it, it's just the principle. It's like, if you're in your thirties and she's in her forties or if you're in your twenties and she's in her thirties, you always wanna make her feel that you are as emotionally mature as her, right? 
The same way, if you're like 30 and you're hanging out with a girl who's like 21, you want to you want to make her feel like she's as mature as you, right? And so what you want to do is you want to make sure that you are matching that emotional intelligence, the way you're making her feel. Uh, she doesn't feel like she's a cradle robber. She doesn't feel like you're too young. It's very, very, very important. And on top of that, if she does point out that you're young, you want to flip the script on her. So this is the next step. You want to kind of, you know, make it feel, again, flip the script. This is what you're doing. You want to make her chase your validation instead of, you know, it being like, oh, you're too young for me. You got to kind of frame it of, hey, you're too old for me. I'm the hot young stud. So essentially what you want to do is you want to act like a young fuck boy, a young male stripper, a young lion, and she's lucky to come into your domain. That's kind of how you want to make her feel. In her mind, psychologically, the framing it has to be that. It has to be, you're the hot young stud. And she's lucky if she gets to take you home. And so if you do these things all together, you should have no problem getting older women, right? Look older, dress older, um, act older, and then, uh, you know, frame it of, you're the prize, right? It's kind of a four-step process there. And once you do that, you're gonna be attracting older women, you're gonna be attracting MILFs, you're gonna be attracting all the prettiest older ladies. All right, guys, thank you so, so much for watching. My name is Justin Mark, international dating coach, relationship expert, and VIP lifestyle development coach. I've been teaching dating, day game, soul skills, and lifestyle development in 50 countries in six continents over the last 10 years to thousands of guys just like you. So thank you so much for watching. If you want to learn more about this stuff, you can go to justinmark.com and you can schedule a call with me. I will personally call you. Okay. We'll talk, we'll get to know each other and we'll see how we can potentially even work together. And the best part is we'll help you get your ducks in a row will help you with an action plan on how to change your life. And if you guys want, you can go to wingmanpodcast.com. Check out our podcast. It's amazing. It's an amazing dating podcast I do with my co-host, Matt Levine. And then you can also go to my Instagram, my new Instagram, drunkjustin2. Okay, my new Instagram. And you can watch my daily Instagram stories where I'm always doing crazy, crazy things, parties, events, caught girls, the craziest things. And uh, you can actually watch my stories there and you can also message me if you have any questions. You can reply to my stories and I'll be sure to message you back. And please subscribe here on YouTube, my YouTube channel here, Justin Mark. And click the bell notification so you're notified of new videos and we will see you guys very soon in a new video. If you like this video, I really appreciate if you leave a thumbs up and leave a comment down below. I will talk to you guys soon. My name is Justin Mark and I'll see you next time.